מוזיקה Billy Budd is back at Glyndebourne Festival. It's one of the major works by English composer Benjamin Britten, whose birth centenary is celebrated this year. The opera tells the tragic story of the handsome, courageous and honest sailor Billy, who's sentenced to death for unwittingly killing his superior. Rising baritone star Jacques Imbrello describes the pure and innocent Billy Budd, with whom he shares many similarities but also plenty of differences. His way of seeing life, of seeing people, of reacting to things is different and which is why he stands out on the ship. I mean, he's such a good, positive person. He sees the best in everybody and, I, and I, I'd be lying if I said that's me. Um, uh, he's certainly a much nicer guy than I am. I, I do tend to, um, when I get nervous, a, 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 a little bit, so I, I can easily see how when he gets nervous he, he, he stammers. So, and I'm young, which helps as well, uh, that, but that, that'll only last so long. Captain Veer is caught between what seems like uh, absolute evil in John Claggart and, and absolute good in Billy Budd. His character is, a, is somewhere in the middle, somewhere sort of confused. The story is told from the perspective of the captain at the helm of a British battleship lost at sea and engulfed in mist, a symbol of claustrophobia and isolation. What's more difficult for Captain Veer is that he recognises uh, a love for Billy that is impossible. Uh, of course, homosexuality is prohibited. It was even in, in England uh, prohibited at the time that the, the opera was first written in 1951. Um, so there's this sense that love between men is not possible. It's, it's, uh, it's forbidden, it's taboo, but it, it can still be felt. Close to celebrating its 80 years of existence, the Glyndebourne Festival is also famous for the elegant attire of its public and the lavish picnic during the long interval. A part of Billy's character is that he strives for what's right. Goodness is best and what right, what's right is right and he loves things to be fair. And I think he understands that he's killed a man, and therefore the law says he has to die. And I think that's, I think that's almost more suited to his, his innocent characters, the fact that if that's right, then that's right. This revival of Billy Budd was conducted by Sir Andrew Davies, a great interpreter and admirer of Britain's. Britain's operas will very much stand the test of time. You know, 100 years from now, they'll be performed uh, and regarded as the masterpieces that they are. The passions and the problems uh, that the people get themselves into because their character doesn't fit with other people's characters. And I think that was the, the, the topic that Britain was always obsessed with. <laughs> 